Okay, when you when you hear the stories on the news, I know most of y'all believe the stories. Oh, let me clean my lens. And that's great. Hey, you should believe them, okay? Why wouldn't you believe them? But if they seem too weird to be true, should you question them? Today, we are told by Austin, the media in Austin, and the uh, economically rich school of University of Texas at Austin, that 13 of the football players, the Longhorn football players, have been tested positive for the COVID. <laughs> I mean, I don't believe that for a split second. And we can agree to disagree. But I mean, this is just plain ridiculous. Do you really believe that 13 young men on the UT team have and then if they do you gotta wonder well what, what exactly is this COVID I mean I, I don't know what what are your thoughts on this this is getting a little ridiculous just just you know we still haven't seen any sick people on a personal level yeah we've got people dying on TV left and right we've noticed the hospitals are still empty still asking people every day if they know anybody that's, uh, you know, got the COVID and passed and can't find a single person who's lost anybody to it. Did have a teacher at Lake Travis the other day tell me that her 75-year-old dad has COVID and he just fought it for two weeks and now he's okay. So, you know, there, there's that. I finally got somebody that, that claims they know somebody that uh, had COVID. But third people oh yeah so everything seems to be going good things are getting back to normal and and we knew they were going to play this game and now in Austin as of the 18th yesterday now masks are required in anything in Austin so I have to go back to my not spending any money in Austin again like I did for months not long ago to just boycott all the restaurant stores everything in Austin but anyway, let me know what you think. 13 football players tested positive for COVID. 